All right, guys, for this Wicker Wednesday, he got us Pockies. Pocky is a Japanese snack. Um, it's basically kind of like biscuit sticks. They cover in uh, different types of yogurt and um, that kind of thing. Mr. Wicker actually was nice enough to include a little history of Pocky. Basically, the premise is there's this company that uh, that made these uh, biscuit sticks. They called them Pockies because it is a Japanese onomatopoeia for the way they sound when you eat them. Oh, that um, makes sense. They Originally, they dipped them in chocolate and they left the handle bare, hand-dipped. Every single one of them in chocolate, that sounds like a awful job that does sound terrible this is actually a japanese box like it, it's just in japanese yeah that is that is cool i think this is probably they give you two in this pack because you have the regular uh chocolate that is sold here in the united states and then here we actually have the chocolate that i would assume would be on japanese shelves i'll just take one of that that is packaged really nice yeah how about we eat up they look good on the cover now it's got, i think that's some milk right here yeah that's milk um Japanese really like milk, actually. They drink a lot of milk over there. I'm not joking. But it's just, um, it's just yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, that's so good. All right. Me and Peyton just decimated this one pack of Pocky. So, you know. You know, I'm giving that a nine. I'm gonna give it a nine too. Yeah, these do not look quite exactly these, the same. Yeah, these are not the same. These are smaller. These are smaller. It kind of looks like wood. <laughs> yeah, the, those other ones were kind of wavy too. Yeah, These are straight, so let's just try it out. It's definitely not the same. It's not the same. Look at the box. Are these supposed to be different? Is this a different flavor? No. These both just say chocolate. Well, these are much better. Uh, yeah. The Japanese chocolate Pocky, I'm gonna have to, these are a nine, but I'm gonna have to give these like a like a six or seven. I'll give these a six and a half. Wow, wow, that does taste like strawberry though. Yeah, I love that. It is good. I like these. That's a nine. I'll give that a nine. I'm giving it a nine. You want another? Yeah, that's good. I have to be in the right mood for these. They, they're, they're selectively gross. They can be good. It's like comedy. <laughs> oh, that looks like, that literally looks like that chair over there. That That's the same shade of green as that chair over there. I can't see the chair. Let's go. <laughs> see, cause I kind of like it. Oh my, no, I, I do not like that. Yeah, I'll give it. I mean, if you really enjoy green tea, this is gonna be, I just, I don't like it. No, this is kind of like reversed. It's got a uh, different color base. Oh yeah, it does. That might be the chocolate. Oh yeah, these smell exactly like banana. Mm, these are good. They're not fat flavor. Yeah, they're more of an awkward middle school um, flavor. They're a chubby flavor. It's okay. It tastes like it tastes like a banana popsicle flavor. Very artificial. Yeah. There's not much chocolate to it. It's okay. I still give it a six. I'll give it a six. That's fair. It's better than average. Yeah. It's not anything to write home about. Okay, so this is the one I've been waiting for. Cookies and cream. I love cookies and cream. Everything. I literally. It, it's it's no contest. Everything that's cookies and cream, I automatically like. If this sucks, I don't think it will. pretty good. I like these. These are good. Mm. Apart from the chocolate, this is probably one of my favorite American Soul Pockies so far. That is a 10 for me. That is a 10. I'll give it a 9. And that's mostly just because I'm not really a big cookies and cream fan. I love cookies and cream. So as someone that doesn't even really like cookies and cream that much, that's still a nine for me. These are really good. You know, Mr. Wicker, he also gave us a $25 gift card to Taco Bell. Mr. Wicker's really killing it. Yeah. All right. You know, Mr. Wicker's just killing it. I, Mr. Wicker has done so much for us for this channel. 
you know, Wicker Wednesdays, funding all this, now giving us Taco Bell gift cards. I mean, he's given us more food than what you've seen so far. We have food for Wicker Wednesdays for weeks. Yeah. Uh, just big shout out to Mr. Wicker. You know, if you don't even if you don't even know Mr. Wicker, you, 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 if you don't even know Mr. Wicker, you need to respect him. If you see him yeah. in the hallway, get, just say hi, give him a handshake, give, give him a high five, introduce yourself. He's such a nice guy. He's the government and econ teacher for the seniors. You know, if you don't know who he is, just ask another teacher. They'll point him to you. Go say hi to Mr. Wicker. You know, meet a new friend. He, he's He's one of my favorite teachers that I've he, ever had. He probably is one of my yeah. He's one of my favorite teachers. Thank you for thank you for giving us a base to yeah. talk about what really we love the most. Yeah, we love food. Yeah, we talk we would we talk about food when we're not even on YouTube. Yeah. So. We like food. Yeah, I love food. We like food. So thank you.